Next to me, I have uh, the course director, um, Professor Associate Professor Fernando Peters, and of course, we're going to talk about uh, New Horizons uh, in Ecocardio uh, Ecocardiography Conference, a very interesting conference. The tenth year is this year, and what is new about it? Well, I think um, the major things that are new for this year is firstly the attendance. Um, you know, we've grown to over 200 delegates. Mm -hmm. And I think the second thing is that uh, the composition of the delegates is very interesting. This year, in particular, we've had a lot of delegates from the rest of Africa. Mm -hmm. We have more than 40 delegates who have come from the rest of Africa attending the course. We've also had delegates from Europe, from the Middle East. Um, so the international uh, attendance is definitely a new development and one that we are very excited about. I think the second development is the fact that there's a lot of young people, both sonographers and cardiologists, who now come here. Mm -hmm. And there's a changing spectrum from the first uh, meeting where it was more older cardiologists. And I think the third thing that was different about this course is that it, there was a lot of case-based teaching. And I think this has, uh, this has been very well received. It's a good platform to educate people. Mm -hmm. And I think the major, major thing that came out from all delegates is that the practical component that precedes the, the workshops, there's a call for more practical training. So a lot of unique things about this year's course. And of course, as every year, you have the support of the European Society of Cardiology. Yes, uh, you know, the European Society, again this year, was uh, represented firstly by Jeroen Bax, their president. and who was sent uh, here and we are very grateful for his contributions. We use the guidelines and there's a lot of emphasis on clinically how to use it. We also have Petros Neonapolis from London who is also here. And uh, I think the important thing is that uh, the contribution of Europe to this meeting is really in the form of sharing expertise and this is vital in this part of the world. And we anticipate uh, the next meeting next year. And do you have any plans? Yes, I think uh, the plans undoubtedly is to try to increase the participation of people in this course. Not just in attendance at the lectures, but we do want to use um, you know, media in the form of perhaps internet and companies like yours, live media. We want people who cannot travel to Johannesburg to participate in live streaming and attend the course. We do need to spread uh, the messages that we bring through, the expertise, and so this is a unique opportunity and we hope that more people will join us. And we want to thank you also for the opportunity that you give us to be able to uh, help you in this and uh, widespread uh, the conference uh, throughout uh, Africa and for you to fulfill your plans. Thank you very thank much. Thank you very much.